movie is there. So actually back for another video. Um, I'm so sorry for not being uploading a lot of uh, video these days. Um, uh, it's been one month or so, a few weeks. I can't remember, but yeah. So I'm glad to be back. Um, I did not upload a lot of photos because it's due to my laptop is down. As you can see, it's over there. So I actually bought a new desktop, and I'm going to do an unboxing video on my new desktop. Um, yeah. Without further ado, I should show you the box first. Oh yeah, so this is the desktop. Uh, it comes with a free monitor, and it's a 19.5 inch. I'll show you. You can see. Yeah. So this is running on a 8 gig RAM, if I'm not wrong, and a i5 processor. So and it have a integrated, not integrated, uh, independent graphic card. So it's not those like um running on your processor one. Uh, so it's separate. Have a separate graphic card. Uh, I was told by my friends that uh, if you want to edit photos, edit videos, or do he he heavy editing sort of stuff for videos and gaming probably, uh, you need a better graphic card. So uh, for me, I'm going to do simple video editing and photo editing. So yeah, I think the basic basic one will do. The, like, the basic um, graphic card is more than enough. More jubun desu ne. Hi! Let's start. So first of all, I'm going to pan through this box for you. Sorry, because I'm wearing my my sleeping pants. Okay, so this is how it looks like from the side. It's actually quite big. I'm not sure whether you can see the whole thing. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. I shall open for you in a fast moment, and the next time you see it, it's going to be open. Let's go. Ooh. Okay, so you see now I actually opened the monitor boxes already. The box for the monitor, sorry. And first of all, you can see this stupid side of phone, as of course it's to protect your monitor. And some manuals. Oh, they got Japanese also. Wow, that's pretty amazing. I didn't expect that though. And yeah, there's cables. Uh, I believe this is the HDMI or something, because you can see this uh, HDMI here. Not sure whether you can see though. Next, uh, we have the power socket, of course. Uh, you know power, no need to power up already. And yeah, I think this is very hard for me to grab. So I'm trying to grab this. Oh, this is the VGA camera. I'm sorry that I'm seeing my laundry because I'm using uh, my wardrobe. Sorry. Because I'm using my um, wardrobe as a base to film videos these days because I don't have a tripod. I'm going to get it soon. Anyway. Yeah, so put that aside. So I'm going to remove this now. Oh, um, yeah, I think this, when I drag, everything will be out. So I'll show you in a while. Give me a moment. Okay, so now actually I assemble the monitor already. So it comes with this stand now, which actually you need to go and figure out how to, how to actually uh, screw the thing onto the monitor and stuff like that. If you can see this is actually, how to say, uh, facing downwards. Yeah, let you see at the side. Um, jeez. Okay, so it's quite okay. So yeah, as you can see, this is how it looks like. Not sure how you all can see. Anyway, yeah. Then um, you can see there's the. This is the power socket, the V HDMI and the VGA camera. A uh, VGA socket lah. Oh yeah. So the monitor is done. Um. This looks a bit unstable. I'm really, really scared for this anyway. Uh, I'm going to unbox the PC right now and show you all guys later. Woohoo! Okay, so I actually opened up the CPU box now. Yeah, as you can see, the first thing you see is, of course, the manual again. Yeah, they are like uh, traditional Chinese, the simplified Chinese, Japanese. This means Seto Apu Kado. Seppa. Step up cut, you know. Um, yeah. So anyway, uh, yeah. So without further ado, I show you what is inside. After I put that there aside, you see this is the. Uh, I think this is the mouse pad or something. Obviously, <laughs> I put that aside also. And I think this is another VGA to connect your, the PC to your monitor, probably. Hmm. Yeah, the adapter, I guess. Not sure. You all can see anyway. I think I might need that. So don't put that aside first. So this one is of course the power socket as usual. 
yeah then see everything is like set up there already anyway yeah uh styrofoam box as usual i give you a give me a, the one moment and I'll show you what's inside okay so actually i uh, removed the packaging already so you can see this is a cpu i already have no idea um how it works anyway because um uh, this is the i think how many donkey years i bought desktop so of course i think you can see this is the power button and yeah this is like quite slick the design then we have the like the trans transparent or you can see through the the casing itself it's actually quite heavy and i think this is a speaker or something yeah that i know mm -hmm. what the front um uh yeah the front this is this part right is actually a cd a cd radio as usual you got the all the usual usb port and i think sound port i'm not sure whether there's one behind um uh, here got some indication of what is inside this casing of course we got the navia geforce graphic card the processor the hdmi port and yeah at the side we also see some uh, main feature of this pc uh, i should show you in a while oh, you're gonna move this oh. okay so i actually make it focus already as you can see um uh, this one is running on a mobile, I mean a Windows Home 64 bit and running on the 7th gen i7, i7 i5 processor have a 2GB Nivea GeForce graphic card uh, one terabyte hard drive, 128GB solid SSD which the SSD I heard from my friend is running on a faster storage uh, so you can retrieve a file faster then we of course have the 8GB RAM as I said earlier um, the CD ROM which I showed you earlier at this side, right? Uh, actually you can read or you can actually burn CD. There's an integrated card reader, sorry. And of course they have a LAN and wireless probably. Uh, so you don't need to go stupid all the way to connect LAN these days. Of course it's around Bluetooth. So everything is inside already. Cannot show you most of this but I can show you this is running on the Acer lab. It's an Acer X. Acer what? Acer X780 X780 So we're going to see the casing Sorry Uh yeah Another part I think this one is the power If I'm not wrong Then this one is the socket to enter the power I'm not sure they cover this for what Anyway yeah I think it's a force shutdown or something Not sure about what is this uh, This is like the free space we have Probably you can add in stuff These two, these two also and there are four USB port and one uh I think this is a USB three. Oh yeah, they have the sound port behind also. That's great. Oh. Oh, now I really need that that thing, which I show you earlier. This one, I just sort this thing to um to be compatible with my lap the monitor earlier. I guess this one is the HDMI port. Or, oh yeah, HDMI is this too, sorry. I'm not sure what is this for. Uh, probably someone can tell me next time. Oh well. <laughs> this is the, how to say, the LAN, LAN socket. Um, probably you use it in a very old time. When you have the old, old desktop, uh, no more wireless stuff, then you probably use this. Lah. And yeah, what else I can say about this thing? Uh, probably that's pretty much about it. And I'll show you... Uh, I guess I'll show Oh yeah, before I end this video right Um, the video The video The desktop actually come with the The wireless keyboard uh, As you can see And the mouse This is also the wireless mouse All these come with the like Oh god, give me a battery also That's cute And I think there's a USB port Which has to I mean USB port The US, USB socket Which actually you need to uh, attach here To actually make it work so without further ado, I shall do a pre-run of the of the computer and I'll tell you what's my what's my view lah. Without further ado, I shall go get it started. Okay, okay, so I'm actually back for the um, wrap up of the unboxing video. Um so sorry that I didn't have to I didn't have time to go through to review the desktop itself. I actually set up already, um, put everything on the desk uh, to help with the validation of the the computer uh, because uh, when it's 
too hot, I scared the motherboard will spoil or something like that. Yeah, that's pretty much about this video. Uh, I really appreciate that uh, we all stay until the end of this video. Even though I really seldom upload videos for the past few months or past few weeks. Yeah, so what to expect for the upcoming weeks? Uh, we're gonna do a Braces Up video tomorrow, and of course, um, probably do a new Mina san Yomi Ma show. <laughs> but I think I will just briefly read what I can read, lah. Cause usually when I do the Japanese reading, uh, it's not very accurate. Cause my pronunciation is not very well. It's just like um, I'm reading to myself because I'm trying to do understand the the passage, understand what I'm trying to read. Cause it's in, in other words, it's still a foreign language. So yeah, to me lah. Yeah, that's pretty much about this video. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap up here. Um, please uh, give me a thumbs up if you like this uh, unboxing video, and if you like to see more of me doing more videos next time, please remember to subscribe. I will do more videos because I didn't do the past past few videos for the last few months or last few last few weeks, right? It's because um, my laptop is down that I actually cannot do anything about it. So yeah, and my work laptop or my uh, school laptop, right? Uh, I actually cannot do heavy edit editing on it uh, because it's uh, very, very uh, slick laptop just for travel around uh, I can do live photo editing though yeah that's pretty much about it um, sorry about that uh, this video might take a bit longer yeah, bye bye see you in the next video bye bye